Hi friends, it's your teacher, Miss Croft. Today I'm going to show you how to use a subtraction strategy in order to solve a subtraction problem. Are you ready? All right, let's go. So the first thing we have to do is we do have to read our word problem first and foremost, always. So our word problem says six people are swimming, then four of them go home. How many people are swimming now? Okay. So let's look at some things that are really important to know. So I know that six people were swimming at first. So I'm going to underline that. And then I know that four of them go home. So I think that means that they leave, so they're not swimming now. So my question, I'm going to change my color because I'm going to circle this, is how many people are swimming now? So how many people are swimming? Well, let's see here. Can I go to a different color? I'm going to use my circles, just like I did for addition, only I'm going to use them now for subtraction. So I know that I had six people swimming. Oh, and you know what? Ms. Groff's going to have to fix this. Sorry. Let's try a different brush. Maybe it'll work better. So I know that there's six people swimming, so I'm going to draw six circles. Three, four, five, six. So then I know that four of them go home. So I think that means that I'm going to have to get rid of four of my circles because they have to leave. So I'm just going to cross out four circles just like this. And I'm going to double check. One, two, three, four. So then my answer is going to be how many people are swimming now? So my answer is, that's really bad too, two people are swimming. Okay, so I'm even going to include my label. So I have two people are swimming now. Okay, now we're going to go back to our Nearpod lesson and you're going to actually do, try it now with a different word problem. Are you ready for this? Remember, we draw our total number of circles, and then we're going to cross them out since we're subtracting and getting rid of them. Okay? All right. Let's get ready to go on your own now.